What a f situation this is. You know, he's been waiting for his opportunity to prove his worth, to do a bit more than he's been tasked to do. I got it. And so when he gets called upon to do something, you know, extracurricular, go with, with the boss's son, uh, it's like, yeah, let me grab my stuff. I can't wait to go. Does he know how far he's willing to go, what he's going to be asked to do, and does he know where his limit is yet? No, I think he's just happy to get in the car, and then he's going to figure it out along the way, and then guns come out. And, you know, we get to a point where, you know, we're seconds away from pulling a trigger and killing somebody, and he stands up right there. Forgot to ask me for my keys. So I think he's going to forcefully push through these people and circumstances and time until he gets what he wants and demonstrate that he can be trusted and uh, that he's a very powerful asset for the work that these people are doing. How fast do I need to go? Tell us about your... Your, had you ridden a horse before? Cowboy I had Taylor? never ridden a horse in my entire life. In my audition, Taylor Sheridan said, so you you, you ride? Not to ride a horse. Uh, and I said, you know, Taylor, I, I've spent a lot of time around horses. <laughs> <laughs> and I had never ridden in my life. Figures, come here. Give me your shit. But I'm lucky, right? Because you guys are supposed to be hard, tough cowboys. And Jimmy, he's not a hard, tough cowboy. <laughs> No. So I just get to like, you know, you I get to be really, uh, exactly. I get yeah. to sort of learn alongside With Jimmy. Jimmy. Oh! Yeah. Whereas everybody else comes in there, Dave Annabelle, Luke Grimes come in there. They're supposed to be the sort of hardest, best riders yeah, there yeah. are. And they are, they're tough guys. They're very tough guys, but I, I had it easy. It's easy. Easy. Because uh, all Jimmy's supposed to do is learn. Easy. He doesn't have to be an expert. My horse's name is Colt. I trained with Colt. Yeah. Um, so we got a really good opportunity to get to know one another. He's a stubborn four-legged animal. Yeah, I've got the easy mode horse, and Denim's got the hard mode horse. You, you got, you definitely high powered. He wants to get after. He has issues. Bit. He's thinking about stuff. My horse yeah. is like, he's chill. He's like, you you couldn't piss him off if you tried. Mm -hmm. They're like every day before they're like, hey boom. man, is it bo boon. Boon. boon? Boon. They're like, hey, we're gonna put Jefferson on you. Just go easy on him every yeah. day, and he does. He's cool. He's like the he's the 4 J Smith of horses, you know. He sort of got my back, slow, steady. Yeah, steady. Yeah. Yeah, but with purpose. Oh yeah. With I'll be like, horse. come on, Boone, come on. He'll be like, bro, the mark's over there. Just chill. <laughs> yeah. Let me He'll be like, it. no, bro, you're blocked. Yeah. The eye line's blocked. I'm taking you over we here. Gotta, we gotta do this. Yeah, he knows what he's doing. He's like, hey, Jeff, dude, you keep rubbing on your mic, man. <laughs> <laughs> you really, you really fucking he's with the got sound department. Yeah. He's, like, <laughs> he's got monitors. Yeah. He's giving you what was that? Boone's in the monitors in between takes. Boone's like, I just need a little bit more. Hey, Jeff, just relax, bro. A lot of tension in your in your vocal cords, right? Remember how we did that saddle exercise before? Yeah, he's my combination horse and acting coach. Yeah, he also, so, yeah, he also does yoga classes on exactly. Saturdays. It's really weird. <laughs> to mellow me out. He does nutrition. He's like yeah. making smoothies. He's always been big into hay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's going to get it, Jimmy. I don't know. Tom, go down there again. Come on. Oh. Sometimes I feel like disrespectful to even get on a horse with how good they are. You know, like it's, I mean, I'm a decent rider, but I could spend the rest of my life and I wouldn't be half as good as these guys are just the pounding on their bodies. And I think that I'm sore after sitting on, just sitting for a shot <laughs> for like eight hours. I'm like, my back and my legs hurt yeah. and everything hurts. And it's like, they're on circuits. Like, cause when they're not filming, you know, they're on a circuit. When a cowboy needs extra money, he wins it. What their bodies are capable of is pretty, pretty remarkable. And like four, he has competed. Wins it how? Bronc riding, roping. Bulldogging, cutting, all the shit we do every day. But you can barely do it as it is. Forey oh. has been cowboying his whole life, but he's also been acting for 40 years. So he'll give you advice about everything. It's cowboy as it gets right there, Jimmy. He'll be at the crafty table and he'll be like, you want to know the best way to peel that orange? <laughs> <laughs> and he's, it's good advice. It's, yeah, I mean, there's it's no good wrong advice. way. Rough business becoming a man, ain't it? <laughs> He's gonna kick my ass. <laughs> yeah, it's just... You don't like my advice, Jeff? <laughs> Jimmy, you ain't got sense enough to pour warm piss out of your boot. No, he gives great advice. And because he's been doing this for a long time, he looks out for us and feels like Lloyd. I think Forey... Yeah. The, the boundary between Forey and Lloyd is pretty thin, which is amazing. 
That's why you don't go to the bar without me. It's amazing to have this actor who's been doing it for a long time. He's been cowboying for a long time, and then he's in his element. Like, and he's in his element. You know, it's his backyard. My favorite party thing is, you know, it's like five o'clock in the morning. You know, we're getting out of the van, everyone's dog tired. And like, Forey, how are you? I'm just happy to be on a call sheet. <laughs> <I'm just> like, <laughs> yeah, bro. Line. That is like him. You know what I mean? Like, he just loves it so oh much. My God. And that energy really is infectious. And that's the difference but, between Forey and Stephen Williams. Because you say to Stephen Williams, hey, Stephen, how are you today? He just goes, beautiful day until now. Not good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not good. I'm not good. Getting too old for this. Yeah, Forey's yeah. been up. Forey's like, wow, late call time today, 4.30 a.m. <laughs> been up since 1, didn't know what to do with myself. <laughs>